Michael Jordan and Jerry Krause. No, Jordan didn't come to the uh, ceremony, <clears throat> and Krause got booed, and his widow had to hear it and all that. Uh, Jordan made no secrets how he felt. Those were on record, you know. And see, obviously the Jordan and Scottie Pippen thing, the tension has gone on with that. So what makes you think that Jordan, how he felt about the general manager wouldn't go on? You know, players are going to always feel like they are. Jordan was told by the owner, Jerry Ryan stuff, that I don't know if I should give you this $30 million. He said it to him in 97, 98. I remember it very verbatim. <clears throat> I don't know if I should do this. The man brought behinds to the place. Merchandise sold like crazy. He was a league MVP. He won all those rings. And you're going to sit there and say you don't know what you should do. Today, you can't even give the milk carton cat that's 11 deep on the bench less than 15, 20 million a year, 20 or 15 million a year. And that's what he was telling Jordan 25 years ago. A guy that changed the course of the marketing of the game as well as being one of the greatest players ever of the game. And you sitting up there shrugging shoulders, acting indifferent. So, of course, he's got some strong words and some choice words for how it is. I think that people always wanted Jordan to be political, and he wasn't going. He was going to be tactful because he had to work within the system. But you never know how he. Well, you saw how he felt. <clears throat> he didn't show up, and he didn't have any respect for the general manager. And that's the fact, you know, because the relationships and what are said and what's done, you know. And you see, you got to understand something. <laughs> I just can't think, well, I made you, I put this around you. You bring a team together, and that's the truth, but you got a leader. And if you're not respecting that leader, there's going to be problems in situations. So Jordan made no secrets of how he felt about Cross. And just like how Scottie Pippen has gotten his feelings about this, I'm sure the Krause family and people like that got in their feelings too, but it's still carried over to the fans because the fans only go by what they see in results. Your hard work and paying tax paying person, et cetera. You don't want to see a crap team when you had a chance to keep something going, you know, better rather have fallen off the rails than to have to be dismissed because you don't want to keep it going and you feel like you should break it up. I hate to see good things come to an end, especially when, you know, until it's meant to be an end. And that was a travesty in Chicago <clears throat> about what happened with Jordan and all that. So that's my thoughts and takes about that. And the Jordan Krause thing is pretty serious because it does have a lingering effect and impact. You know, sometimes you can't hide your dismay. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome thoughts, comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for nothing. Share if you like. I'm on peace.